joined by the hosts of the Tony and Ryan podcast, Tony Lodge and Ryan John Dunn. Hello, team. Guys. All right, we're on our way to Channel 7, and because I'm a nice guy, I've asked to do a segment about Tony's dog. Uh, but because I'm also a nice guy, I asked to do a segment making Ryan look like a total goose. <laughs> So we got off to a pretty weird start. We're talking about how people use Airbnbs for parties, but Larry says... And porn too, apparently. Porn? What? People are <laughs> renting it out, renting houses to film videos and things like that. Oh, like suddenly the pizza guy arrives. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know your story pretty well. Kylie. I saw it on TikTok. Like, I'm never staying in an Airbnb again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What I uh, expected. <laughs> So this is a bit sneaky. We said we've got a topic about baby names and pet names, but it was really just an excuse for us to talk about our dog. Discussion on the Tony and Ride podcast, which yep. we love. Yeah. It's crazy. <laughs> uh, giving pets human names. While it seems cute, Ryan, you've witnessed uh, sort of an uncomfortable side of this, an undesirable side of this. So my partner and I are hoping to start a family soon. And uh, my cousin, Rachel, they're, they're trying to start a family and they're just recently engaged. And we've noticed that all the good names are being taken up by dogs. So everyone's having a dog's name, a dog with a human name. We go, well, we can't use that now. Oh, our yeah. cousin's got a dog like that. Oh, that girl, I knew one of the girl with that name in high school. She was a bit of a mole. We can't use that either. And suddenly, there's not that many names left. Right. So did, have you... Na I, you know, sorry, you've sorry, there's all the names that you can't use for that reason. Can I just ask, how many girls in high school can't you name your dog after? <laughs> <laughs> just the one. Just you, Larry. <laughs> Forbes is at home and I've asked him to film Pippa watching Mummy on the TV. <laughs> Are you going to give her a shout out? Yes. You a puppy into your life. Yes. I did. So you, you stole a good name. I think yeah. I did. Was Pippa. Pippa. Um, except since naming her, because I tried to avoid human names, um, then once I named her, I got a lot of uh, messages on, oh my god, isn't she cute? Oh. I got she's a lot of... Frenchie too. Yeah, I got a little Frenchie. Oh, look at her. Oh, she's watching the home. Mummy says hello, Pippa. Oh my god. <laughs> Pippa, who's on the TV? So I told Torbs, even if Pippa doesn't realise that Tony's on TV, just tell Tony that Pippa loved it, because Tony will love that. Oh, did Pippa end up watching you on TV? Oh my god, yeah, she loved it, of course. <laughs> then I got a lot of unsavoury messages on Instagram. Apparently it's quite a dirty and graphic word in Swedish. Is it? Don't yeah. Google it. Oh. Don't Google it. Oh. Yeah. yeah, I mean, you wouldn't want to film that in an Airbnb. <laughs> <laughs> now, Ryan, you've, uh, your dog's name is BJ. It's BJ. Yeah. Uh, Can't which film that in an Airbnb. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it is awkward when you're yelling it out at a park or a playground. Um, well, particularly at a park. But, yeah, but there he is, uh, little Beach, what a legend. But Ooh. is BJ short for something? No, no, don't he, ask. Please he, don't ask. No, don't ask. Yeah. What you, the question. Don't want the answer to. <laughs> no, I don't like Brian John. Yeah, that's well, it. That's it. Yeah, that's it. Go with that. Go with yeah. that. Lovely. <laughs> what, a, what a fun segment is this. <laughs> Lucky you guys only like turn up occasionally. Yeah, I've got a list rude. of things to Google when I get home from uh, from today. Tony's about to tell his story about something I did on the plane. She has to change the words a little bit because have a look what she actually said in this text message. Well, I text Ryan and said, if I turn around and see you standing in the aisle, I'm going to be really embarrassed. And so I filmed the full aisle and then panned back to Ryan and he's standing there <laughs> waving. Who stands up on a plane? It's <laughs> so embarrassing. Where are you going, Ryan? Um, nowhere. Nowhere, it would turn, it would seem. Oh, you um, weren't sitting together. That's no. why I couldn't. Oh, okay, right. Yeah. You're like, Larry and I, we don't travel together. No. Ryan yeah. refused. He was oh. like, I won't yeah. be seeing uh, you. Will, you will notice that Tony was sitting a little bit further to the front yeah, than like I was. Yeah, so. 1A and 27B. <laughs> Okay. When you stand up, so you're a stander upper upper up. Well, I, because we were not in a rush, but I was keen to, you know, get off the plane and get into town here in Sydney. And then I was so excited. Then I ended up standing there like an idiot for 10 minutes. And I had Tony filming, pointing, laughing at me. And I felt like an idiot. But I, I will say that uh, it is lucky that I had an aisle so I could get up because I wouldn't want to, you know, the people who were in the, like the window seat and then they and end up there yeah, sort yeah, of yeah, just standing there like this for the whole time. So, um, I mean, it's not that bad. You wouldn't have got past me because I, I tend to like do this. If <gasps> You would oh, you too. I would. You would. <laughs> I'm like, not your, t not your turn, 27 B. Yes. Not your turn. Yeah. Wait till 18. Well, goes, does that happen then... when you turn left at the front? Is that what? <laughs> you have to ask Larry. I'm not, I'm not familiar with. I didn't know there was a left turn. 
<laughs> oh, dear. oh, yeah, I look at people turning right and go, what's down there? <laughs> I thought that's where they keep the petrol and the luggage. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, what's the age cut off for double strapping your backpack? That's my question to you. I have. Uh, how old are you? I'm 35. Yeah, Larry, I think you'll find it's a lot. I think 25 is the last time you can put. Wait, like he, he, he had his backpack on like a, a child going to his first day of both, primary school. Yeah, both sides. Double straps. You wouldn't yeah. be in the first oh. hundred people this year to call me out for wearing a backpack, but I think it's convenient <laughs> look, look, and it has look, all look, my look. stuff in it and it's fine. Double strapping! <laughs> <laughs> That's all from us. Hope you loved sharing the day with us though. <laughs> Make sure you like, share and subscribe and comment, share the link on your Facebook. <laughs>